everybody welcome back we're doing another marvel future revolution video quick tip beginners type thing or maybe not because honestly i didn't know this several months into the game so uh i wanted to show you something with that real quick it's going to be a short video if this is the first time you've come to the channel check out the discord link in the description below try to do some beginners or quick tip type videos we've got a little series going to that also other content stuff coming up anything that might be of interest in the game uh also hammer down like buttons notification bells and subscribe if you like right let me know what you think about this tip and whether you thought about or you knew about it i didn't know about it or if there's anything else i'm missing all right let's check it out bring me wolverthor Okay, so let's just get right to the point here. This could, this could be the quickest video of all time. So first off, I'm going to do raid, right? And you can see today's raid. Today's raid. We've got three of them, right? So which one of today's raids do I want to do? Now, I'm going to actually do this raid because I've got a reward count of one of one. I'm not going to show you the whole raid. Don't sweat it. This isn't that video. Uh, I will fast forward that part. I'm going to pick my difficulty. I'm going to do this, but again, fast forward this part and show you what, exactly what I'm talking about. So I'll get in here. I will use my reward and then not have one or, you know, and then I could have other ones and I will show you exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, so I just finished my raid. Yay, victory. Rah, rah, rah. So I could, you know, I could click this to get more rewards, right? I'm not going to show you that right now. That's not what I'm here to do. So I'm going to exit out of this. And this is the point of this video. Whatever it is, one minute in or two minutes in. I could have done that. I could rerun these. I could also, if I need this, could keep running this. Now, Loki's raid's not today. I could run Fenris. Fenris's raid's not today. All of this today's raid means, see how it's 15, 5, uh, 1, well, 55, 715, 5, 1. If I come over here, 55, 7, 15, 5, 1, plus you get some extra boxes here, so you can get some extra of these Convergium. That's it. So when it says today's raid, you could do whatever you want. You just get extra rewards for today's raid. This might seem simple, but I legit, and maybe it's just me and zero other people knew this. And that's fine, but I'm going to put it out there. And if this helps zero people, well, that stinks, I guess. But I'm hoping to at least help one person. So again, I could go in here. I can run Loki. If I just if I choose to do my rewards here, I could, and I will get these rewards. So if you say you don't need anything but Loki, and you've got all these other races, man, I gotta wait all the way. You don't have to wait all the way to Loki. Keep doing Loki. You just don't get the extra boxes. Now I would advise that even if you don't need call or vision or whatever, I would still do the double raid days. Because, I mean, there might be a point where you actually want to specialize or put these specializations into your alts. I know I'm getting to the point even on Black Widow that, you know, I don't have all of my main traits, you know, filled in. You can see this here, but I don't plan to necessarily. So, you know, and I'm at nines out of all, oh yeah, all of the stuff that I've actually equipped or would want to equip, I'm at nines at. So unless they expand this tree, which I'm sure they will at some point, they'll probably branch this thing off somehow and add some things. But I really only want green, purple, red, um, green, purple, red, what was the other one? Yeah, and yellow. So, you know, and it's really, I don't need that much red. So if orange pops up, if Fenris is day, I think it's Fenris, I could skip, right? I could skip and just do one of these instead. So, you know, that's really what this is kind of coming down to. Um, I mean, in these, the success rates are, these are so terrible. It's kind of like, okay, so like, let's say 20%, right? Guess what? It's going to fail. Hey, so there you go. So now I've got all of these. I could go craft some. Obviously, I got a ton and try to make more of these to do this. Um, or I could just take a long time and keep doing it. So the point here is if I just need Loki, just run Loki. Again, you don't get the, the extra rewards, which is like two to three of the extras. Of these you see that typically when, uh, when I just ran the... <laughs> Oh, excuse me. When I just ran the uh, vision rate, I think I got three. So is it like, is that worth running vision if you don't need vision? So that is the main thing I want to share with you guys. And uh, I'll throw it on here too, is even if I didn't need any more of these, what you want to do today is reward, load up on these. So that way, if tomorrow 
is the raid I want. I can get these two plus my, I think it's at least three more. You get your free one for the day and your two refreshes as well. It might be just four, I forget, but you can, you can double up. So if I didn't want to run this, I can wait till tomorrow after I ran my one, get the extra two and go ahead and save for tomorrow. Or I could get the, I think I could get the three, it'd be sitting on three do it tomorrow and then get the two refreshes for tomorrow if that's raid. So that way I run that particular raid five times. So uh, I did want to mention this for the raids. So if I, like I mentioned, if you already knew this, great. If you didn't, I hope it helped. Uh, let me know below if you knew about this already. And if, you know, I'm just curious. One thing I do want to mention too, for some folks uh, who might know this and might not know this, you can use, because of this, once you don't have any reward counts, that means you can always go into a character like Kingtron and test out stuff. Uh, he's probably the best one to do it uh, because he's a solo target. Vision's a little wonky, jumps around a lot. But Kingtron, you know, he's just there. It's a small spot. He's always sitting there. So you can go ahead and test out some builds. Uh, I was talking to Neuromancer about some stuff that uh, he's been shooting. And I was like, hey, you know, Kingtron is something that you can just continue to focus on. This was not my idea. I know Half Sen's been doing it for a while. I think some others, Ravager Britcher and some others have been doing it uh, within X-Force as well. But uh, I wanted to throw that out there in case you weren't aware that, you know, sitting on Kingtron is something that you can go ahead and do over and over and over. So with that, that concept in mind, uh, we've also got Invasion going on, right? So uh, in Invasion, you can go ahead and go back and you don't need to do the rewards. Uh, let's go back to the headquarters here. You don't need to go, go ahead and do these rewards um, each, uh, each fight. So if you want to go do the ones and the twos and the threes, you don't need to reward those. Or if you like the rewards on these, um, you can, uh, great. So I, same concept here. You know, I can select my difficulty. I select five. I do my battle. Now in this one, there's no extra rewards. It's just, you just do the, the one you do, right? And you get what you get. But um, so as you see, there's 516 and then two, what are the omegas, right? Uh, or I'm sorry, the battle badges. So level 93, uh, level 93 through 6. And this one is probably, what, 110? Yeah, 55. So a little bit more there. And then the 110. So you get the different badge boxes, uh, the different levels there. But let's just assume for a second you want the higher level badges. You could sit here and so use your one and now and be done and go back and do these and just, you know, run them for more points or whatever you want to do. Uh, for this one, you can see I'm not I'm not super far along. I, I like running the rewards here. I would want to see, so in these other ones, these are level 90. And in the, in the, um, in this, this is going to be interesting. I'm going to be looking at this for the first time here um, on, on air with you here, but this collection. So this level 30, level 30. So I still need this level 30. Um, I still need several of these. This is interesting. So like, so to f this is kind of actually uh, terrible here. Now that I think about it is like, I need these, um, you know, best event. I did that video the other day. Now I'm starting to be like, wait a minute, how do I get these? So like, I have all of these in progress, low level ones to do. Um, and that's a lot of work. Uh, and it's a lot of free tickets for things. That's kind of like, okay, so, you know, do I want this one to three costume box and try to get these, you know, I might actually go back to some of these nineties. You can see the, even my uh, level 90 again, my level 110. I've got those because I've run it so many times with rewards, but these other ones, I, I've barely, I've barely gotten anything. So you can clearly see that um, maybe I need to reconsider running some lower stuff here to be able to get some of these. So something in mind, uh, I was going to sit here and tell you about how you don't need to refresh that because, you know, why would do it? You want the higher rewards, but maybe, I don't know, you know, um, maybe you do want to do it to try to get, I mean, draw tickets, uh, you know, a costume box, a, a card box. I mean, I guess it depends how much you're going to get there. Um, I think I'm going to try to do a couple of these today and see how quickly I can get them. Uh, I mean, you know, maybe I'll do one right now and I'll, I'll solo it and uh, see what I get. So we can kind of, uh, you know, see these level 30. I'll do a first one, level 30, or maybe I'll do a 50 one. But uh, you can see I've really only got one, two, you know, not a lot in any of these. And we'll we'll see real quick what I actually get running. I won't, I'll, I'll clip through this part, but uh, I'm going to go ahead and do this to see, uh, you know, is it worth running those lower ones or not? Okay, so let's see. Who'd we get here? 
So I got, um, let's see. So I got a level 90 and another level 91 and a five. So, uh, let's see here. Um, I don't remember exactly what I got it. You guys in the video, I suppose could check real quick and go back. So that's where the question becomes is, is that sort of thing worth it? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Um, Midgardia. All right. I mean, yeah, I got a couple. So, I mean, I suppose it depends what sort of badges you want, whether you can want to get those draw tickets. I actually might start doing this, I think, for the day and just kind of using some tickets. You get so many of them. It's kind of like, okay. And um, the problem ends up being that in the, um, in the actual challenge here, you know, you want you want to get you know in five you get what 20 20 of these uh titan seals and then in four you get 16 so you know you start not getting the titan seals so that's where it's kind of like okay so i think that's part of where some people you know in four all the way for the low one so you start getting a lot less of those which kind of feels bad because you know when you're talking about um wanting to go into the store here and going into uh where's my titan seals uh all right, so I had to go to the Titan Seal crafting here. So, you know, I need, I want a, you know, a selection box, right? So I want the, I want this one, which is 1600. So maybe once I got to 1600, that's when I'd consider doing that. So I would, I would stay in level five, get to 1600, see if you can get there. If you can't look at some, maybe some offers, I hate to say that, but, um, you know, decide what you think's best. I personally want the region selection box. Uh, I, I want to do that for not only nano, but, but for specifically selecting things so I can build my and hope for better, uh, you know, Midgardia type gear. So anyway, uh, that's what I got for this video. Hopefully some of this stuff helps. I uh, appreciate you guys stepping by. If you've made it this long, check the Discord link in the description below. Hammer down like button, notification bells, subscription buttons. And until next time, I hope you have a wonderful day.